WWE Universe, let him talk to you. I think LA Knight may let his fists do the talking tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Hagerstown, Maryland. Weighing in at 230 pounds, LA Knight. Well, I knew the day would come when the entire WWE Universe would know LA Knight's name. It was a top name in NXT the moment he arrived. Same result in WWE. Here comes the street champion. His opponent from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 250 pounds. Solo Sikoa. The younger brother of the Usos, but had a far different upbringing. When Jimmy and Jay were getting their start in WWE, Solo was still getting into fights on the street. Solo Sokoa set for competition here, clearly focused as ever. Focused and with a target acquired, Cole. Sokoa's never not in a bad mood. We can already see he came ready for a beatdown. Strangely, I think beating down his competition is the only thing that eventually puts him in a good mood. And even that's debatable. Just look into his eyes right now. Well, he's in there with a world-traveled competitor in L.A. Knight, which means he's got his work cut out for him. Knight arrives where the action's at, in a car worth more than most humans' lives. He seeks out obstacles, overcomes them, and snags a blonde on the way out the door. He says it's his game, and by all standards, it is. Whoa, oh, stiff headbutt. Oh, Sokoa holding him at bay. Headbutt! We often talk about the smash mouth style of LA Knight, but his athleticism sometimes gets overlooked. Corey, which aspect of his entering game do you think will be the most integral here? Athleticism's great, Cole, but you can't discount the power of a simple, in-your-face offensive style. That's what's going to work for LA Knight in this match. Looking for an early pin, and only a one count. We'll need to get a little more to put this one away. Oh, what a really great swinging neck breaker. He's absorbed some damage already. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Bump handle. Powerball. Picture perfect example for when you just want to put someone down with authority. Getting him into the corner. Oh, kicks right to the midsection. Opponent dropped in the corner and mud hole stomping. The proverbial mud hole has been stomped, and now it's time to walk it dry. And a nice takedown. Oh, my gosh, what impact. Power slam. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. Oh, that'll rattle you. Talk about cocky, gloating after placing the knee on the back of the neck. Reversal! What a counter! These two having an answer for everything. Check this out, guys. Double underhook coming. Byron's gonna love this. Doom Buster! We've seen how damaging pile drivers can be, and that one looked particularly painful. He really thought that was it. Set up in the corner of the ring.
slam. And Sokoa on the receiving end again. And there's that in-your-face smash mouth. From the top, drop kick, missile style. Oh, boy, he's stalking him. Watching for an opening. Uh-oh. He takes control. Crucial turnaround there because Solo was falling behind. Yeah, Sokoa getting some newly determined focus. Bullseye! Short clothesline hits its mark. Capitalizing on Sokoa's mistake. Right to the gut. What a headbutt. Vicious. Knight denies the attack. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Measured knee drop. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Oh, enough already. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. Knight has his shot lined up. L.A. Knight kicked to the gut. L.A. Knight with the BFT. The lights are out for Sokoa. Wait, what? Wow. That's pretty unbelievable, Cole. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Right to the face. Heading up, he's thinking big. He's reeling, slowly getting up. From the top, middle of drop kick finds its mark. And nice firmly in command. Sokoa needs to better assess the situation to turn this around. Hoist it up. Burning hammer! The ability Knight has crafted around the world was on display with that one. I hope he kept the engine warm. This one could be over any second now. And Sokoa isn't looking helpless anymore. Solo could be turning his fortunes around. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. This isn't the smartest thing to do. Antagonizing your opponent instead of attacking him. He's trying to intimidate his opponent one more time, but he's got to strike soon. Not allowing that to go on any longer. After what we've seen so far, you cannot question the lengths these superstars are willing to go. The limits of physical exhaustion are being surpassed at this point. Sakoa just unable to stop this attack. Knight has his opponent figured out. And more attacks up there could leave him stunned. Each blow affecting his equilibrium. Oh, oh, Climbing to the top rope. He's lining him up. Oof. Able to reverse. And Sokoa needed that badly. The U-turn he needed in this match could have been right there. And responds with a counter of their own. Reversals, reversals, and more reversals. Catches the leg. Great job refocusing to reverse that. They're slamming their face down. Knight has become relentless. Solo's perseverance being tested. This place is going insane. The ground beneath my feet is shaking. Hoist it up. Down. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. L.A. Knight with B. Knight stamping an end to this. Two. Raise the roof. He's got the victory. Here is your winner, L.A. Knight. Grabbing the win in this one is a serious accomplishment. No doubt about it. Support for this guy grows by the second in the estimation of the WWE Universe.